ladies and gentlemen. We just got done talking to the Night Vedels on the last episode, and we're fixing to go talk to the boss in charge of Fort Atlas of the Brotherhood Steel Dawn Fallout 76. This is Grim Reaper here, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Alright. Cool, let's go ahead and drop this little button to get the. Oh, wrong button. Gotta change my damn buttons around. Uh, we gotta go up. Okay. Keep fighting like this. Here. I don't really know why there's a door right there. You better watch your mouth. I'll shoot you. Alright, Paladin. Brahmana. Brahman. You must be the one I've been hearing about. Paladin Layla Romani. What do you need? Uh. What have you heard about me? I've received a report from Knight Shin detailing your assistance in his duties. He has given his approval to your consideration as an initiate. Word around the fort is that you've been working with Scribe Valdez as well. Uh, so you're in charge of this place, right? Paladin, I'm the commander of the first expeditionary force to Appalachia, and by extension, the ranking officer here at Fort Atlas. Uh, I was hoping to join the Brotherhood. It takes more than hope to join the Brotherhood. Knight Shin has spoken in your favor, but you would also need Scribe Valdez's approval for me to consider your candidacy. Scribe Adelza wrote me a letter. Well, Read about between that. Between this and the report I have from Knight Shin, we can discuss you becoming a member of our order. Consider it carefully. Do you wish to join our ranks? Uh. Uh. Shin and Adelza both well, recommended I've given their approval to your initiate consideration. Yes. Uh, what Shin said about Shin said that your attitude regarding the role of the Brotherhood in relation to the civilian community was questionable. Nonetheless, he felt your intentions were honorable, and suitable training would correct any deficiencies, which means he probably thought I'd like you. That remains to be seen. <laughs> Cocky little shit. What did Vidalza have sure. to say? Capable, helpful, and possessed of a higher than average technical aptitude. Useful qualities in an initiate candidate. I have yes. other questions. Uh, I don't know. You seem like a jerk. Like jerks. I know we can seem cold to outsiders, so I'll let that pass. What I want you to understand is that we are committed to helping the people of Appalachia. We want to aid in the restoration of civilization, and you could be a part of that. Consider it. Uh, what would it mean if I Membership did? in the Brotherhood is a commitment to honor, duty, and service. You would begin as an initiate in our ranks. With time and training, you may one day join the scrolls as a knight or scribe, depending on your aptitudes and choices. On a day-to-day -day basis, Knight Shin would be your direct superior here. Though any of the officers may requisition you for missions if needed. Okay. I would like to join if you'll have. Recommendations of Knight Shin and Scribe Valdez. I'm willing to consider you for membership. But first, I need to see how you handle yourself without direct supervision. In order to be effective in our operations here, we need to establish positive relations with the people of Appalachia. If we make them see us as a beneficial presence in the area, it will be much easier to secure cooperation in the future. We have reports of feral ghoul attacks on traders and travelers in the southwest forest region, indicative of a net of bounties. I want you to clear it out. Uh... 
complete this mission satisfactorily, and I will grant you initiate status within the Brotherhood. Yes. Where is this nest? Our initial reports on the attacks came from a family of farmers, the Putnams that we passed on the way into the region. I think their sons were rather starstruck when we showed up. I almost expected the older boy to follow us when we left. You should start your search there. They may know more. You can find them at the old Lewis and Sons farming supply. I think I have everything I need. Do this, and you will be one of us. With all the rights and responsibilities of a full member of the Brotherhood of Steel. Add Victoria. Let's eat something real quick. Alright. Walk up out of here then. <coughs> to Appalachia, she calls it. Appalachia, but whatever. Which direction am I gonna go? This way. And I'm overweight. Is it at? Oh, Lord have mercy. It's way over there. Let's stop here at the train station first, turn in some of our script, and straight on over there and get that started. Clear out the nest of goos. They mo goos. All right, here we go. Let's turn some of this stuff in. Whoa. I'll actually probably keep that. Double shoes Tesla. And then that can go. And I don't have enough. Alright, then that can go. And then that can go. Well, let's go get this mission started then. We'll teleport here at the Nuka Cola plant. This is awesome. I'm glo so glad that they came out with this early. This is awesome. What do y'all think? You think the ghouls are going to be hard to kill? I doubt it. Not with this thing. Executioner's explosive laser rifle. 
I doubt this is going to be hard at all. No reason to fear. I am here. Oh, wait. Oh, I gotta enter. I thought there would be like 60 of them outside or something. I will kill you all. Don't you point your weapons at me. Don't shoot. I'm just, I'm with the Brotherhood. Again? Oh, man. Cool. I told you they'd be back, Colin. Lower the gun, George. All right. Why don't you come over here and we'll do this more carefully next time. All right. If you say so, I'm just saying you saved your own life there. You was gonna you ain't saving my life. Oh, I thought that was a girl. You get your hair cut, dude. Now you need to be more careful waltzing into people's homes. It's a good way to end up with more lead in you than tail feathers. I'm Carol Putnam. This is my husband George. Now, won't you tell us why you're barging in here and maybe we can all be friendly when you're done. People are cocky as hell. Do you greet all your visitors with guns? Not all. Just the ones that waltz in unannounced looking like trouble. Wow, I look like trouble. Oh, and I shoot you right in the forehead. This is your farm. The sign outside said Lewis and Sons. Might not be Lewis or Sons, but this here is ours. So Lewis was a cousin of mine back in the day. He and his family didn't make it when the bombs fell. We were looking in a good place to put down roots, and we heard it was safe to come back to West Virginia. I told Carol we ought to see if this place was still here. Even after all these years, there's enough salvageable tools and such to make starting a farm easier here than your average homestead. Didn't see any point in updating the sign. Uh, the Brotherhood still sent me to ask about the ghoul attacks in the area. Those military types in the heavy armor that came through here recently, right? I'm the one that told them about the attacks. Those Brotherhood guys are so cool. You're recruiting? I, I want to sign up. Their gear was pretty fascinating. Settle down, boys. The adults are talking. So you want to know about them ghouls? I really dislike this lady. Uh, Paladin Re uh, Remina sent me to find out if you knew where the ghoul attacks are coming from. Certain. We got a suspicion, though. A lot of the sightings and attacks have been from folks traveling the highway to Flat Rocks. They come out of the hills, northwest of West Virginia. And the only thing out that way is what's left of the Orwell Orchard. Could be the source of the things. You don't wipe them out when you find them. Plans to clear the place out entirely. You'd be doing everybody in the area a favor. That's for sure. Safe roads mean safer traders. Good for everyone. The Brotherhood would definitely be making friends if you pull this off. Well, that's my goal. Thanks for the info. I should get. I should head out. Startle us if you drop by again. George has a hair trigger with that shotgun. Look, bro, you'd shoot me one time with that shotgun. Destroy this whole house. Just so y'all know. 
Well, I gotta talk to George for like to join the band. I know I'm not as strong as my brother, but you gotta have a need for somebody smart, right? It's that big decision, Colin. Are you sure you want to join the Brotherhood? I'm sure. This farm isn't the place for me. The Brotherhood could change the world. It's where I belong. Can you make me a recruit? Honestly, Colin, I'm not sure I'm willing to re recommend you, though. If you can help me. Alright, that seems fair enough. I'll do my best to earn that recommendation, I promise. Are you sure about me, though? I know my brother wants this, too, and I heard Mom. Only one of us can go. Well, I didn't hear that. Uh, sure, you're my pick, Collins. I want you to come with me. That's incredible. Thank you. <laughs> you go on ahead. I, I need to talk to my folks and say goodbye and that kind of thing. I'll meet you at Old Red Orchards. All right, then. To Appalachia. What was that? Oh, okay, it's a cow. I thought it was a bear. Oh. We'll go from this guy's camp. Then work our way over to it. We gotta go kill her out a ghoul's nest. Where them goes. in here. There. Oh, shoot, we're almost dead. Jeez. There's a player here. Did you come at? Well, she walk up on me like that. Locate here the ghoul attack. Locate this the ghoul attack. Um, sure. robots we don't see no damn ghouls oh wait a minute now we're talking Oh boy, look out of him. Wait a minute. That's that boy we talked to. I'll fix a snipe the hell out of you, dude. Is this a fucking vault? 
No, it ain't no vault. It's quite nice though in here. You're here. It seemed like this was the place. I had to sneak past everything outside, and then I heard some noises deeper in here, so I just hold up to wait for you. I hope that's okay. Keep your head on straight, follow my lead, watch my back, and we'll both get through this just fine. Don't worry, I will. I'm as ready as I'll let's do this. Alright. Guess we're going this way. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, wrong button. Hell up off him. The hell did that? Oh, we're gonna fix this, right? They whooping in. Get your back, buddy. Don't get off me. Jesus, there's so many. The hell up off me. What the hell you? Oh shit. There's another one. Yeah, don't matter how many there are. Oh, hey friend. That's a good sign. Thanks, Reeling. I know how that would have gone if it was just me. How was your first combat experience? Oh, I'm so shaken. I'm really a little worried you're so casual about it. I guess I can handle it, but if I have the choice, I'll stick to books and machines. Thanks. Still want to join the Brotherhood? Might not be the most brave in a fight, but you must need people to keep everything running. And at the occasional moment of terror, there's a price for getting to work with their tech. I can live with it. Uh, you did all right, Collins. You should pack up and head to Fort Atlas when you're ready. Thanks again for keeping me alive, as well as giving me this chance. I'll make sure you and the rest of the Brotherhood don't regret it. Be safe out there. All right. But uh, that's where I'm going to end off this video. There will be definitely an episode four. So...